With the world population crossing the 8 billion mark on Tuesday, parents across South Asia are worried over the future of their newborns. While Bangladesh being densely populated is facing a huge resource shortage, India is approaching to become the most populous country by next year. Parents in the South Asian countries are fretting about the future of their newborns after the United Nations announced that world population has gone past the 8 billion mark on Tuesday. Adil Ahmed, father of a newborn in Dhaka, said he worries how will the future generation cope with the limited resources in his country, Bangladesh, with a population of more than 140 million. Parents in one of the most densely populated nations fear whether they will be able to provide proper education and upbringing under such conditions. Ultimately, the people who are living in the world are living in the world. They 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 are living in the world. Meanwhile, in India, the mother of a newborn said she believes her baby needs to be extraordinary to tackle the competition in this population boom. Other new parents voice a similar concern. What if their children are deprived of resources in future? As per the government figures, India's population growth has averaged 1.2 percent since 2011. United Nations estimates India may become the most populous country by 2023. I think uh, it will be very difficult for him to, uh, you know, grow. Like uh, it will be populate population is explosion explosive, so which it creates lots of noise and you know other factors are there. It it has uh, lots of competition in education factor and and uh, you know in jobs factors also so for one needs to be grow he needs to be extraordinary in all aspects as looking at the current population rate with the large population of nearly 1.38 billion india is faced with the challenge of creating infrastructure for its rural hinterland and transforming its youth bulge into a demographic dividend of a skilled workforce thousands of candidates apply for a single post as unemployment rate remains at 7%.